Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will discuss some more concepts related to uh, the bit manipulation. Suppose there is a number. Let's say we have 39. So how is 39 represented in binary? 32 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1. Fine. So bit position 1 is 1, bit position 2 is 1, bit position 4 is 1, bit position 8 is 0, bit position 16 is 0, bit position 32 is 1 with the leading zeros. Now if uh, someone has asked me, asked us to set the fifth bit position as 1. So this is the first bit, second bit, third bit, fourth bit and fifth bit. So someone has asked me to put the fourth, uh, fifth bit position as 1. It is earlier 0. Now it is expected that we should make it, make this 0 as 1. So for doing so, what should we actually be doing? That uh, there should be a number in which there are only zeros, but this fifth bit should position should be 1. Okay, so the number 39 is 100111 and there should be another number in which this fifth put position is 1 and rest of the numbers are 0. Fine. Now if we or these two numbers if you apply OR operation between these two numbers, so 1 OR 0 will become 1, 1 OR 0 will become 1, 1 OR 0 will become 1, 0 OR 0 will become 0, 0 OR 1 will become 1. That's what the change we wanted. 1 OR 0 becomes 1, 0 and 0, 0 OR 0 will be, be 1, sorry, 0 OR 0 will be 0, and any 0 OR 0 will be 0 only. So what has happened that this one is this one, this one is this one, this one is this one. Here we had 0, here we have 0. Now what we wanted that this bit position should be 0. So by applying a, an OR between 0 and 1, this number has become 1. So we have actually achieved the desired task. 1, 0, OR will be 1 and for the rest of the number it will be 0. So we should do this, this kind of the operation by which we can set the bit. So we, we should have another number let's say this is known as the mask okay so we should have a mask on which the bit position 5 should be 1 so how can we do so how can we set the fifth bit position as 1 in this mask so suppose the operation that we are carrying out is set bit operation in this set bit a number x is given which for any particular position we need to set this as 1 okay for this kind of the number the x is 39 and the position is 5 so let us suppose there is a mask which is 1 okay mask is 1 so 1 means all zeros only the least significant bit is 1 now if we apply some left shift operation to shift this one on the left hand side. So for how many bits should we shift such that at the fifth bit position we have a we have a one. Okay. So if you apply once one time shifting, if you apply the let's say the number is zero zero zero, that one. If you apply one time left shift, the second bit position from the left from the right hand side will actually be one. If you apply another time left shift. So the third bit position from the right becomes the 1. If you apply another time, means this was the first left shift, second left shift, the third left shift. So the fourth bit position from the left hand side becomes the 1. If you apply another time, the fifth bit position will be set as 1. Okay. So if you have to set the fifth bit, it means we should perform the left shift operation for four times. Okay. So, 
वन लेफ्ट शिफ्ट पोजिशन माइनस वन बाय दिस वी हैव सेट द डिजायर्ड बिट इज वन नो वट वी एक्चुअली शुड डू वी शुड डू एक्स एंड सॉरी एक्स और we should apply the operation x or mass okay by the set bit function we were expecting that the fifth bit position will become one so whatever number we are actually getting from x or mask we should return that fine so if this is a function set bit then we are returning the x or mask which is setting up the bit okay now suppose we have to perform another operation which is clear bit clear bit means uh, there is a number given as x and a particular bit position we want a zero for example here only in the in the if, if the number is 39 the 39 is represented like this 100111 if we want that sixth bit position which actually is 1 should be converted to 0 so what should be apply suppose we have this number is 100111 one, one. One, 1 2 3 4 5 6 so 6 bit position is expected to become 0 so for this what we want that every number on the left of this and every number on the right of this every bit on the left on left of this particular bit and every bit on the right of this bit should remain same the only change we want it in this bit so for that let us say this number is 0 all other numbers are 1 and then all other bits here on the left hand side is also 1 and if we apply an and between these two so 1 and 1 will be 1 1 and 1 will be 1 One and one will be one. Zero and one will be zero. Zero and will be zero. And one and zero will be zero. So we have achieved the the desired one if we are counting it from the left hand side. Let us see about the left of this bit also. Zero and one is zero. For all the bits, zero and zero, and this will be zero. So we have actually got the desired change. if we have the number or the mask like this how can we find it once again let's say we have a one and we are applying a left shift operation up to position minus 1 as we have done in this task also in the in the set bit by this one will come on the left hand side at some position when right? if you are doing it uh, for the sixth bit so the mask is one left shift position minus 1 meaning that the sixth bit position is one now but rest of the bits are zero we want this kind of the mask so if we apply not of mask meaning that all the ones will convert to zero and all the zeros will convert to one in that case we have found some mask like this if we are doing and with the original number we will get the desired result okay so not of mask and x is your desired result and you can return this fine so it's very simple if you have a mask in which uh, at the desired position we have set one and rest of the numbers are zero rest of the bits are zero then if you are <coughs> applying uh, the negation of this meaning that uh, every zero will convert to one and every one will convert to zero and once we have found this mask if we do the and with the original number we will get the desired result okay now suppose we have an operation in this flip bit flip bit means 
the number is x at some position we want that if the number is 1 it becomes 0 and if the number is 0 it becomes 1 fine so we want the flip of the bit what can be done let's say if the number is let's say this only <coughs> 39. So, 39 is represented at this. Now, if we want that the bit position 6, which is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, bit position 7. So, bit position 7, which is 0, this should now convert to 1. What should we do in that case? In this case, we would like that every number on the right hand side should remain same every number of left of this bit should also remain same the only change we want is in this bit okay how can we do those and uh, do so let's say we have a one here right and on the right hand side we have all zeros on the left hand side we have all zeros if you play the exclusive or operation then one xor zero will be zero sorry 1 different bits 1 xor 0 will be 1 different bit 1 xor 0 will be 1 different bit 0 xor 0 will be 0 0 xor will be 0 1 xor 1 1 xor 0 will be 1 because the different bit so up to now we have received the same bits as the original number if you apply 0 xor 1 we will get 1 what is this actually earlier the number was 0 now, if you apply 0 x or 1, this number has become 1. So, we have flipped this, flipped this bit. And now, before this, we will have 0. 0 x or 0 will be 0. 0 x or will be 0. So, all this will be 0. So, what we have seen that, if you are applying the exclusive or, or operation, so 0 has been converted to 1. Now, let us verify it for, if, if, if this converts uh, 1 to 0. Let us take the same number, 1, 1, 1. 0, 0, 1, 0. Now what we want that let's say this third bit should become 0. We are flipping the bit it means it, if it is 1 so it should convert to 0. So if you have a mask like this fine, 1 x or 0 will be 1, 1 x or 0 will be 1, 1 x or 1 will be 0. So it was earlier 1 and now it has been converted to 0. 0 x or 0 will be 0, 1 x or 0 will be 1, and rest of this will be 0. So we applied the flip with the help of the XOR operation. So if you have to write it in the form of the code, what we will do? We will take a mask, which is 1 left shift position minus 1. After this, we should apply exclusive OR with this mask and we should return this number. This will flip the desired bit. Right? Thank you.